Welcome back, you're watching Alive in History. My name is Tyler, and today we're in Petersburg, Virginia. As you can see over my right shoulder, I'm at the site of a monument that serves to commemorate some of the colored troops that fought with the Union here at the Petersburg and Richmond um, sieges and campaigns. To get a closer look at this, Very cool. I'd like to show you guys a few other things uh, while I'm at this location at the Petersburg National Battlefield uh, Battlegrounds. They have some entrenchments over here that are obviously remade, uh, but it's really cool looking. So let's get a closer look. Here's the sign to these infantry earthworks. I guess that's a, uh, like a, I don't know if that would be, I, guess, I think it's just like a K or a, a cabin barracks. Pretty cool, you can see the bark is still on the trees there. Oh, and the, uh, the roof, just pretty much a bark roof, it looks like. Anyway, um, let's look at the this encampment over here and the the trenches. There was a lot of trench warfare that went on in this area, so I'm pretty sure that's what this is really resembling. You can see uh, it's hard to tell over the video, but <clears throat> that's probably about a six foot deep trench right there. And you've got these wooden planks coming out here. Definitely would not want to attack that. So, pretty cool. Over here, we can see there's a, a cannon. So this is something like uh, what the Confederates would have built in this area to defend Petersburg, and more importantly, their, ca their capital, Richmond. So you can imagine uh, how daunting of a task the Union would have had to attack these entrenchments. Actually, I was just reading, um, the longer the sieges went on, or this campaign, the more rare uh, uh, entrenched attacks became, um, because it was just so devastating. The losses were horrendous, so the Union actually just focused on uh, pushing west to cut off the railroad supply, so the Confederate Army would just be cut off uh, from all their uh, supplies, food, ammunition, things like that. So essentially starve them out is what they were going for. You can see here's a cannon. Pretty cool. Very well defended place. And again, this is just a rebuild. Uh, we are on definitely on some of the ground that it could have looked like this, but uh, yeah, this is all rebuilt. Pretty cool. Hope you guys enjoyed that little video. I'm gonna keep going down the tour trail here, here, and uh, sorry, it's been a long day. It's really hot, uh, but I want to see the crater yet, so. Once I'm there, I'll probably get you guys down again and do another video, if not some more. So hopefully you enjoyed it. Hopefully you found it interesting, thought-provoking. And until next time, remember, we are alive in history. Take care.